chow time. I gotta get them some fresh water. I gotta feed them. They are nuts when it comes to feeding them because they all want to eat each other's food. Oh look, Denny went and got him some fresh waters. So I don't gotta do that, that's nice. Cause when I go out and feed them in the mornings, it's super early. It's super early when I can feed you in the morning, ain't it girls? Yeah, it's super early. So let's see if we can put this here. And it don't fall, and you can just maybe get a glimpse of just some of the craziness that ensues. It's feeding time. Now go and eat, Nugget. There's one. There's two. Oh. Extra for the pregnant girl. Now the trick is to see how long they stay in their separate places. And I had to put, per well, that was nuggets. I've had to move that thing a hundred times. I was about putting one over there. But we had a temporary one over there and it didn't work. Because heifer here that's in charge thinks she needs to go take everybody else's food. So you got to try to keep them far enough away from each other where they won't even remotely see one another. Because, see? Minnie, get your fat tail over here. She will try to run. Pearl off of her foot. Go back to your food. Your food is in there. Go back to your food. We had one long trough. It was fine. And then they started fighting each other. So we put a divider in it. Well, that worked for a little while. And then this one would just beat the other one out of it. So we put her one over here. And then the nugget was born. Now that she's eaten... These were too tall for her, so we had the one down there on the ground, and it worked well. Well, now she thinks that she's second in command, and so poor Pearl is regaled to eating over there out of that one until we put her new one up. Get your fat heifer tail, Minnie. Minnie, move yourself. Remove yourself. You have got food, Minnie. Go. Go. Get on your food. Your food. You have got plenty. You get extra. You're fine. She wants to take everybody's. It's not like she don't eat, y'all. Look how fat she is. These babies is coming on. And she eats plenty. She gets a cup and a half twice a day. Now, look what you just done. You run your own baby off of there. Go, go. Now she's going to try to get Pearl. Pearl is a speed eater. Pearl has learned the hard way, ain't you, Pearl? She's learning the hard way. Pearl has become a speed eater. Y'all, act like you're starving. They're not. They eat plenty. I promise. They get all they want. And then I get to feeling bad and I'll still give them extra. No one good and well, they don't need it. Now everybody runs back to their home place and gets their own. And they just fight over pans and go back and forth. And I just don't understand it sometimes. They don't know food grow cold around these parts. 
And that is in addition to the hay that I'm fixing to fill back up that they clean out twice a day. And then Todd ends up coming and giving them extra hay. And they get to go out every single day, at least once, if not twice, sometimes three times, and go out and eat acorns and eat grass and leaves and whatever else they want out in the woods. It's just a race to see who can eat it the fastest. Come here, Nugget Nugget. Come here, Nugget Nugget. There's some over here. Earl, you didn't clean that out. There's something else. They and a lot of times I don't even think they're hungry. They just race to see who can get done faster, so they can go steal the others. See, there's still food in there. She just left her food to go try to get her food. She'll leave her food to try to go get her food. She'll leave her food to try to go get their food. It's the darndest thing I've ever seen. Quit! Quit beating each other around to steal each other's food. There is plenty of food for everybody. And look, that's Mama, and she's knocking her baby off the food. There's something else. Food wars. They ain't none of them lacking, I can promise you that. They are all overweight. Pearl's about the perfect size. She's good. But this little fat baby here. Yes, her is. And Mama over there, she's always been a food hoarder. All right, let's go fill these babies up with some hay, and I'll see y'all tomorrow.